Let's just chat a moment about that last boomerang you saw on my story here. You, your health is the most important thing you have going on right now. And if you think I'm wrong, please, please shoot me a message, prove me wrong. But your health is the most important thing. You cannot take care of your family. You cannot get to your job. You cannot make the money. You can't do anything without your health. Am I right? So if health is so, so important to all of us, then why are all of us not prioritizing it? We'll prioritize the family, the work, all that stuff over our health. And I hear it all the time, I would die for my kids. Why not live for your kids? Goodness sakes. Why not take care of yourself so you can be the best you can be to be there with your kids? So you're not sick and feeling down. You know it, we are going to pay for it one way or the other. We're gonna pay for your health now with taking care of it as an investment. It's an investment. You are going to invest in yourself now or you are going to pay costly medical bills and costly prescriptions later. It's a no brainer. When we invest in ourselves, it has the best ROI, right? You know, I don't have to spend, I don't have to like spend all this time at the doctor's office or waiting on my scripts and paying a fortune on scripts. You know, I flipped my spending onto highly nutrient dense foods and I don't spend any more on prescription pills. Taking care of yourself is way more affordable and way more cost effective, <laughs> way less expensive than disease and illness. And we're human. We know what our bodies need. A plus B equals C. So you're going to end up with certain results if you don't take care of yourself. We're smart people. We know what's coming down the road. Maybe we don't feel it now, but we have this whole ecosystem going on inside. And we know what's coming if we don't take care of it. Let's not play with something so important as our health. It will come. And I have had, I had a friend, an old friend of mine actually reach back out to me who now has a debilitating illness. And that's why, that's why I'm doing this spiel today. She, she now has this debilitating illness and said to me, I, I would have joined you a year ago, Laura. I could have nailed this, gotten this taken care of way before it turned into such a disaster. So sad. The good and and bad, the good and sad, I'll say, of all of this is it is preventable. I mean, it's good because we can prevent it, and it's sad because we can prevent it, yet so many people still don't choose to prevent it. I mean, I hear so many people say, well, I have a family line of whatever. Okay, yeah, we have family history of disease, whatever. But you are either feeding that disease or killing that disease every day. Just because you have a family history of something, it does not have to be your fate. So please work with me. Let me help you heal. Let me help you feel better. Let's get to the root of the issues. We only got one shot. One shot at this life. And I want you to feel good.